Hello guys, so Mr. V here again for another video for you guys. Uh, today's gonna be a little different than my series and of course it's not gonna be on Monday on Wednesday. That's why I'm uploading this a different day. And it's gonna be a little haul that I did because I went pop hunting with Funko Pop Isle, aka Jeremy. So at first I was doing so good, I wasn't buying nothing. And then, because I was encouraging, because he was buying pets here and there. And then I saw one of these guys over here. And that basically started from there. After I got that one, I bought the other one, then I bought this one, then I got this one. I went from now, there, and then, and then, and then. And somehow I ended up spending like over a hundred bucks today. And I think I spent more money than his. Um, you're gonna see him and probably sure gonna put either his channel link down below or the video down below because he's gonna do another um, separate haul for this um let's get started so everything started with stop comic i had to train in some pops for store credit and then i saw this on the shelves and they got a restock for them and i got the deadpool px exclusive uh over here so this is a px exclusive and as you know guys know that i collect every single um deadpool basically for now on and this guy is with the suit as you guys can see over there in the glam um and he's pointing too he's like pointing and with the ham the other part like open so this is another pop that i had to have i didn't i don't know for some reason i didn't even have it but I was lucky enough, and as soon as I walk in, I saw it and I got it. Then, from there, we went to Walmart. And thinking that this guy was the new one, but I can see that this one was just a repack, but I don't have it either way. So I went and got it anyway, so it's a Rubedus Hagrid. Um, this is the one that he's holding the umbrella in his hand. Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna find the other one. I wasn't sure if I was gonna get this box because the black box I'm gonna get it anyways just because of the box. Because uh, I'm a completionist and I'm like that. I'm sorry if I trigger some people, but I'm like that. Um, even if it's a duplicate, at least for some of the series, I'm like that. Um, so yeah, this is how great this is gonna go. This is a six inch Even though the box is like kind of thin and everything, but he's a six inch and he only cost me $12.99 on Walmart He's gonna go. I'm gonna rearrange my Harry Potter wall. So I'm gonna keep him over here. Actually, let me put him to the side Because I have more pops coming in So now I'm trying to do this as fast as I can because I have a lot of pops to show you guys and then we went to Hot Topic. Remember I told you guys like I was gonna do some training in and basically I have one pop that Jeremy needed. So I stood up to the side and then he found this pop in the wild. Well, I wasn't looking nothing at all and this is the first chase that I ever seen on the wild. And it's from Hot Topic. And then I trade this chase for that pop. I wasn't mad about it because it's uh, I just really wanted that pop to go to a good house and I know Jeremy's gonna take good care of him. And I got this chase, even though the sticker is like peeling off, but I can fix that easily. So I got the Superman from the Flashpoint chase. Um, we found it in the wild, it was a plus. Um, then the whole reason we went to, because we went to another ball that they have Thinky on it. They had that hot topic that we found that. They had game stuff. They had box launch. And what else they had? They had Target, they had Best Buy. And the Barnes and Nobles. So of course, I'm gonna leave this for last. This is from Target. We went to a game stuff and I found this sitting on the shelf. I found my first official chase. Even though it's not a pop, but it found my first chase. Uh, so it's a uh, Batman chase pass, pop pass. And the only difference is like he is like pink instead of um, black and blue. But it's a really nice chase, and it's my first chase. I almost killed Jerry for it. 
Uh, he probably gonna tell you guys about it later on. Okay, so on the same hot topic that we found the chase, I wasn't gonna leave empty-handed because by that time we haven't talked about the trade. So I was like, oh, let me just not get go empty-handed. And now I'm into the pop pocket key change, but I only collected Stitch. So I saw this one hanging over there. It's the Hot Topic exclusive Aloha Stitch. So I got it. And I already have the regular Stitch that I got in another place. And they were buy two, get one. But I just saw like they have a little pins. So I got a pin from Harry Potter. And I have another pin for Overwatch. I'm probably gonna open like um, after I show you guys why I have. Then I went to Barnes and Nobles. Um, fun fact: the Barnes and Noble that I bought this, I don't know why, because these are minis. I was gonna buy six of them, and he told me you can only buy two, because it's two per person. I'm like, they're minis. I'm like, yeah, it's two per person. I'm like, okay, then I will take two then. Cause the thing is that these minis, I was gonna buy the six of them because these minis you cannot find it easily right now. So I basically got two more minis of Cuphead. Um, I was gonna buy six, but I got two. I don't know why. That person was, I don't know, new? I don't know. Cause I know they do that for the phone calls. I didn't know they do they do that for the minis. Think Geek Hall. The whole reason I'm gonna leave for last, but I went and got one, two, three, four, five, and six of the Black Light Five Nights of Freddy's. Cause I'm trying to finish the set, so I was like, they have a whole six over there. Let me just get them. But then they had the buy three get one free, so I went and got two more of the first series. I think it is. Cause this is the twisted one and the sister locations. Uh, Five Nights of Freddy's mystery minis. So I got two of those because they were free. And then the whole reason I went over there because they have that one. They have this over there and it was the last one is the advent calendar from harry potter uh they had yeah you know, the 24 days one so they're pretty sure they had 24 um i think they're pine side heroes or vinyl figures oh they are pocket pops so they have pocket pops inside and they have some exclusive i think then they don't have nothing in the back like saying which exclusive they have but i'm pretty sure they go up one up to the 24th uh i don't know if i'm planning 12 days of christmas with this or i'm gonna do the one and uh, open one every single day on my instagram account i don't know what i'm gonna do with this one yet because it's gonna be for you guys of course but i don't know yet I don't know yet what I'm gonna do with that. Then to finish my hallway and uh, before I open the pins, I we kind of went to Target just to look, and they have one pop over there that is street dated. But this time today is the 13th, and they're street dated. I think for the first of December, and we found it over there at Target. We got the Condemned Elf. Target exclusive from Fortnite. These guys are street dated for the first or December. I don't know how, but they had it in the shelf. Um, they have a bunch of them. Pretty sure they have like probably like 24 of them or less than that. But they have a bunch in that Target that we went, and they have it out. I'm like, I told the Funko Pop out like we need to get out with this, but we need to do the checkout. Uh, things help check out because I'm pretty sure this is street data and they won't let us buy it So we went to the self checkouts and we get out with it. So we got this Two because I needed this one anyways. I needed the love ranger Because I had the other ones over here 
I got the color theme, I got the reindeer, I have the skull trooper, now I got the love ranger, I got the commander elf, and I got the merry mother, and I think that's it, because I have, yeah, that's it. That's all I have, and now I'm gonna open the pins. This is one pin per thing. I really like this ones, because they have what you can get in the back. So hopefully, hopefully, hopefully I get something good. So we just got the Hogwarts pin. They don't have, um, I guess, it's one, one, two, three, but it's six, nine, 12. So I guess it's one in 12, in rarity, but we got Hogwarts with the moon in the back. I don't know if you guys can see it over there, but that's Hogwarts with the moon. And, from the Overwatch one, it was kind of weird because I basically got almost all of them except for the Tracer one in the front. So I was like, wait, this is, I should have taken another one then. So I got the Diva one. I mean, if you guys saw my picture from Instagram, you know I'm a Diva main. So this is pretty nice. I got the Bastion one. And this is probably one of the that people doesn't know about it, but this is Faras because of the rockets. And that's her ult. So I got three pins that I really enjoyed, even though I don't use Bastion that much, but I'm a Diva main and I'm a, I wasn't gonna say Ford with Farah. So yeah, guys, that was my haul from the pop that we did, that I did with Funko Pop Isle, AKA Jeremy. And these are the results. Hopefully you guys enjoy them and I'm pretty sure I'm gonna do another one but I'm not gonna buy that much don't quote me on that because once you go pop hunting you want to get everything and that's how I end up with a bill of a hundred plus bucks remember to always stay positive until next time bye bye